Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I'll be doing another Toka designing video. And so in this video I'll be creating, as you guys already know from the title, a grocery store inside Toka World. So for right now, we're going to be using Inside Toka World, which is a house I brought separately there. It's called the Misty Cottage, that brown house that's on my screen right now. So I'm going to go ahead and click inside place. And here's the recipe from the game. It is a pasta mixed with a piece of meat, which is like a meaty spaghetti, which is very good. And so right now, in just a minute, I'm about to be in the place. And I'm going to show you guys me how the house looks before I start decorating. And then I'm going to show you guys me taking out the items that are already come in the house when you restart your game. The items that already come in the house, I'm going to show you guys that. And then I'm going to show you guys my design. So here we are, now we're into the place. This is the Misty Cottage. So here's how it looks before I add any wallpapers or take anything that it originally comes with. So there's some things outside, and I really like the outside, the outside porch. I call it the the front yard because it's just like a, it's out in front of the house. But however, in this video, I'm using it as a grocery store. So this idea was fan requested. One of my subscribers commented on my video, and they were asked if I could make a grocery store. So that's what I'll be making today's video. And so right now I'm going to show you guys around the house, how it looks. So those are all the wallpapers it originally comes with. And now I'm going to go ahead and show how me taking out the items in the house that already come in it. So outside there are some fat little figures and like a little fountain. I'm going to go ahead and take those things out so you can go ahead and decorate outside. So there goes a little bat things. And also a little lantern there. They actually have a couple of those things out there. Just to add a little decoration and stuff. And... Right now, I'm just taking more of the bats. I actually came with a lot of bats out there. There was like th three of them. And right now, I'm just taking them out just so that way we can decorate and we can add more decorations that I wanted to up there, you know, just to make it more like a supermarket. And then there was this pumpkin right here. Really cute duck lands and ever. So right now, here we are. And now we're into the house. Uh, there's so many things in this house that you first get there. So I took out so many different things. So sorry for this taking a little long. But it also comes with, like, uh, as you guys saw, I just took out. That was a little pumpkin, little candy holder. You can open it up there. You can put candy in if you want to or whatever you want in there. You can add books if you wanted to, whatever you like. And so right now, here we are. We're in the last room that actually comes to items in it. And we're taking as This one is a little acorn little candy holder. And so now, voila. Now I'm going to show you guys me in the middle of my process of building. So here we are. This is me in the middle of building. And so right now... I'm going to show you guys me adding in some of my things in there. But however, when I was recording this, I noticed that I forgot to show you guys my flat out um, design so you guys can see it. But so I'm going to go ahead and just a minute. I'm about to pause the video and I'm, then we're going to show that part because I forgot it was a mistake I forgot to do. So sorry about that. But I was a little sneak peek of what I was, was going to do in the house, the, the bathroom. So this little room, I love the doors. So this like what I'm using is right now is the bathroom. I love using it because it just reminds me of the... I love the closed doors. I like how they close and stuff. They never had a designing house at Toka that actually has doors like that, like an open close like that. So it's really cool being able to see one like that. So right now I'm just adding a couple things on the shelves and stuff. Adding in like things you'd actually see inside a bathroom. You know, cleaning supplies, like a bucket of water, some soap. And here's my flat design. So this is how it looks completely. Before I think extra inside of it, there was the outside decorated. This is where people would pay for their food before they leave. And also when they come in, they can ask for anything they need to. There goes the bathroom. And now next is one of the grocery rooms. This will be some of the groceries will be. And I'm not exactly sure where I'm going to put the vegetables and stuff. But you guys will definitely find out in just a minute. And so right now here is the next room with more groceries. Also, there's three chairs inside in case you want to sit down while you're waiting. When so are you looking for your food and stuff. And now here we are. This is me in the middle of my process of decorating into the house. So right now I'm adding in some pineapples into there just to add a couple of fruits in there and stuff and right on the top you guys can see you guys see those like little containers up there those are those are um t turkey mixtures so you mix them with turkey and makes like a thanksgiving turkey and here goes my full design you guys so feel free to pause the video if you need to to be able to copy any of these designs down and also if you want to use the figure trickle world you can see what items i have and so you can get them say you took a place so you can make your own grocery store just like this and also you guys that's the this is the room where people pay so the cashier room basically and so right now if you're wondering what that sign says on there there's two signs on the sides next to the bathroom They'll say Lay's Grocery Store, because that's what my grocery is called. Since my name is Layla, I put that there. It was a really cute design. And I made it inside of another place that got into a world, and which you able to design paints and stuff. So inside of there, I, I created this. And I also added some bags up there and below the paintings, in case you were, did wonder what those were. And so here's my room. Here is our first grocery room. It comes with some vegetables and stuff. It's a candy table right there, you guys can see. It has some light pops, some silver containers, some bread and rice and ketchup, meats, and a bunch of drinks right there. It looks like kind of like like witch's potions, you know, but it's really cute design. And here's my vegetable. 
sorry, my fruits, and that has some popsicles and some more dry that stuff. Like also some salt and pepper, has some gingerbread cookies, some tofu, has some sugar, some soy sauce, some more drinks, and I also have some cheese and some pasta. So thank thank you guys so much for watching this video. I hope you guys enjoyed. Don't forget feel free to pause if you need to to see anything. And if you also have a certain item you don't know where I got it from, do feel free to copy um paint some of the comments with that item is and I'll, and I'll be able to tell you where I got it from. Thank you guys so much for watching. Bye. Thank mm -hmm. you.